We randomized our starters in Scarlet and Violet. Then Tobin and I picked our Pokemon by only knowing their generation. After that, we built a team of six and had a Wi-Fi battle. Make sure to subscribe so you won't miss the next Pokemon battle video just like this. And let's get into the action. All right, so Tobin, before getting into the video, yep. I'm kind of curious, what's your favorite generation? It's three, it's the best generation. There's literally no other better generation. Generation five is for babies. Oh, you had me in the first half, coach. Gen three is also my favorite gen, but gen five is not for babies. Oh, dude, it's so <laughs> lame, dude. It's for new babies. It's for the Gen Zs, bro. I don't love like, those guys. <laughs> that is true, actually, Frank does love gen five. Yeah, exactly. See, you proved my point. And he's like maybe 16 these days, so. Yeah, yeah, he might. <laughs> He might be 18, maybe. Tobin, you can spin around first, and let's pick some starters, my guy. All right, let's see what you got, buddy. Yeah, the thing is with your Pokemon, I would say they're all very average, so. I'll take average. As long as they're not ass, I'll take some average mons. Your first one is generation one. Ooh. Yeah, I got some average in generation one. Most Pokemon from there are average, so. Your next one is generation four, another beloved generation. People love gen four. Oh, they do love it. They screw it from the roof. <laughs> Can you guys tweet us a video screaming <laughs> from your rooftop how much you love Gen 4, please? Yeah, just be careful, though. Just be careful. Yeah, we don't want noise complaints. <laughs> yeah, no, they, yeah, that's what we want to be careful about. Yeah, if you fall off the roof, you'll walk it off. But if you're a little too loud... You yeah, guys, HOA be coming for you ass. Your last one is from Generation 2. Ah, oh, Gen 2. I love Gen 2, but I feel like the Dex is so bland, you know, compared to other generations. Kind of bland. There's some really good ones, but there's also, like, fucking, you know, Quillfish. Exactly. I'm not trying to get stuck with a pineco. Right, it's good for rabbit spin, but that's about it. Honestly, I'm thinking Gen 4. I'll scream it off the rooftops. Fan favorite. Everyone loves some Gen 4. Yeah, I was thinking this is pretty solid. You got Star Raptor. Pretty good. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, a, it's like a good mod. You got close combat and stuff like that, but like it's not like OP or anything. He gets Brave Bird. Ash had a Star Raptor in the anime. I'll take it. You did miss out, though, on a Weeping Bell, which is pretty all right. It's pretty okay. With, mm. with a random ability, it could be pretty good. Yeah, and you also missed out on Ampharos. Oh, I love Ampharos. Bro, this randomizer is so crazy, it's chugging my frame rate. Oh, sh that's not good to hear. I'm feeling a legendary. I would say these are some pretty legendary Pokemon. I feel like they're not legend. I feel like you're lying. My opinion's subjective. <laughs> yeah, I, I was gonna say it's very subjective. <laughs> All right, we're looking at Gen 6. We're looking at Gen 1 most of the time. And I couldn't tell you what generation this last one's from, yeah, Gen to one, be honest. Gen 1 most of the time? Most of the time. What the f*** does that even mean? It's either Generation 1 or it's not. <laughs> he has a form that's featured in another generation. Uh, oh, what the f***? <laughs> <laughs> so weird. I was hoping if we're going to have a mistake in this battle video, it would be like later. So that way the comments wouldn't roast us. But like round number one, right out the gate, I, I do not recognize this guy. You not a, you don't it. recognize it at all. Like you don't know if it's a new Pokemon or not. Well, it's definitely a newer Pokemon. So okay. So I recognize probably, that. Maybe it's probably from this generation. You know what? I No, no, no. I'm pretty sure it might be Gen 7. I'm going to say it's Gen 7. <laughs> okay. Okay. But then, okay. I'm happy. You, okay. That's a little bit of confidence there. We'll go with the Gen 1 because if it's like a Galar form or something like that, it's pretty cool. You got a Persian. Okay, regular Persian? Regular Persian. Okay, cool. Uh, as long as it's not a Lola Persian, uh, that makes me happy. Well, I mean, we can have the choice to make it whatever form we'd want, but see why I said it was most of the time Gen 1? He has a Galar form and there's an Alolan form. Yeah. Well, yeah, but I feel like if you see one of those, you just say the generation that is, you know? Not on this channel. Okay. I think it's Serena's pre-evolution. Oh, it's so like Steeny? Is that its name? I think so. I'm sure. Cool. Is yeah. it Gen 7 that I get that right? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's for sure Gen 7. Good job, good job. Yeah. A few comments. We know these games. What was the other one? You had Halucha. Oh, uh, Halucha's pretty cool, but uh, I'm, I'm okay with either of those. You ready for round number two, Toby? I'm, ra I'm ready. I'm ready. You are not going to be super happy with these, I don't think. <laughs> you don't know me. The first one we have from Generation 9. The new generation from this generation, yes. Next one is from generation six. And then the last one is the way I'm gonna say this is it's from generation eight. Which means it's a Galarian form. Or something else, yes. All right, so we're looking at gen nine, gen six, gen eight. All modern generations. Can we say that about gen six? It's 10 years old now. Oh, we can't say that. Oh, it's like, yeah, it's on the tail. Like, it's like on the beginning of the game. So, oh my God. Isn't that weird? Bro, I don't want to be 30. Don't say that, Tobin. Oh God, I'm going to be 30 here soon. I'm going to pick Gen 9. Let's pick Scarlet Violet. All right, you got Bramble Gas. Oh. <laughs> you have no idea. You don't know I'm what that bad. is. What were my other options? You had uh, Dragology, which I think was like the best one. 
I was about to. Okay. And then you also had a uh, Hisuian Growler. Oh, it's Hisuian. Yeah, but still Gen 8. Still technically Gen 8. That is Gen 8, yeah. Mm. Damn, I really picked the worst option out of all three of those. We're looking at your starters. Oh, that's very good. Looking at Gen 3 which is the best generation. Yeah, Gen exactly. 5, which is for babies. Yeah, for babies, exactly. <laughs> and Gen 6, the ancient old generation. And let me know in the comments if you're a baby. And also don't let us know in the comments if you're a baby, because if you're <laughs> under 13, you can't leave a comment on this platform. All right, so we have Gen 3, Gen 5, Gen 6. So the problem is I love Generation 3, but there are some uh, poopies in there, but we do random abilities. So uh, like if, I, if it's a slacking, so I think I'm gonna go with the Gen 5 because of that. You got the Gothitelle, Tobin. Dude, that's so funny because I, I had a feeling it was gonna be Gothitelle. <laughs> that's like the Gen 5 mascot yeah, <laughs> besides I, Zekrom Rush around. Yeah, if I think Gen 5 competitive, I literally think Gothitelle. That's the first yeah, problem that comes to my mind. The, what was my Gen 3 mod? It was Shiftry. Oh, okay. Like saying, okay, not the best. Dodged the bullet a little. Yeah, yeah. What was yeah. the other one? Vivian. Gothitelle was definitely the best choice. <laughs> Vivian would have, is actually able to sweep, but it's so specific. I'm okay getting <laughs> Gothitelle. Round number three. Yep. Hopefully I get a Pokemon from Gen 3. Oh, we'll see. Let's see. Oh my god, you actually did. <laughs> I'm gonna pick it. Give me that slacking. You don't want to hear even hear the other choices. <laughs> no, I, I should probably hear the other choices. <laughs> okay, okay. So for your first one, it's Gen 3. Okay. The next Slacking. one is Generation 5. Again. For babies. Yeah, but good competitive. <laughs> oh. And then the the next one is Generation 2. Which I mean we don't we don't really not, like not idea. I don't know, like, I could get, like, a Typhlosion. I could make it a Hisuian Typhlosion if we want. Yeah, I guess, yeah. But statistically, I feel like Gen 2 has the most stinkers, so... Yeah, so it's, it's between Gen 5 and Gen 3 is what you're saying. Yeah, we did establish Gen 5 has a lot of competitive mods, but we also established that Gen 3 could have slacking, so I really want that slacking. It's not a slacking. Oh, is it Vigoroth? Nope. Oh, was it Slack Off? You actually <laughs> got a shiny Rayquaza. No way! Full yeah. on! No, that's nuts. Out of all the shinies to get, that's such a cool shiny to get. That was insane. Yo, I'm down for some shiny requests. I can put that boy on the thumbnail. Oh my god. Okay, you, you, you love your options. We've got Gen 9, Gen 1, and Gen 4. All right, so if, if, if I'm going to love my options, that tells me that Gen 9 for sure is one of the good ones then. Because Gen 9 has some stinkers in it, but the ones that the ones that hit, they, they hit. I'm going to go with Gen 9. You got a Skeledurge, Tony. Oh, Yes! Oh god, I love Skeledurge! <laughs> Skeledurge! 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 What were the other options? You could have had Lapras? That would be nice. Actually, that would be a really good for Rayquaza. Or Leafeon. That's okay. That's okay. All right, let's look at your status. Look, look at them. They're aesthetically pleasing, I would say. <laughs> this time you have Gen 2, you have okay. Gen 4, and then you have Gen 8. So I've not picked anything from Gen 8 yet. Yeah. So I'm going to go with Generation 8. That was definitely your best answer. You got a Reggie Draco. <laughs> oh, hell yeah, I got a Reggie Draco. <laughs> oh my God, dude. You're, you're, I need, I need, yeah. I desperately need a fairy type with against your team. This is stupid. Ooh, Tobin, you're not going to be too thrilled about these starters. Well, it's one of those days, it looks like. One of those days. Looking at Gen 3 with big thighs. You get an extra hint this time. Big thighs? Large thighs. From Gen 3, we got Gen 8, and then we have Gen 9. Gen 8 and Gen Nine. Okay. All right. Well, I'm not pleased with any of these answers. I'm having a feeling that it's spied up. So I'm going to go Gen 9. You got Tatsugiri, Tobin. Ah, uh, he's not yeah. so good unless we're doing doubles. It's fine. <laughs> what, what, what did I miss out on? Roly Coley from Gen 8. Metacham from Gen 3. Okay. Large thighs. Well, happy I didn't choose that one because with that with random abilities, he is not very good anymore. <laughs> uh, let's take a look. Let's take a look. Oh, shoot. These are all good. Oh. These are all really good. <laughs> let's go. Uh, your first one's Gen 1. Your next one's Gen 9. And your next one is uh, Generation 4, we'll say. Gen 1, Gen 9, Gen 4. I think I'm leaning towards Gen 1 because I've already picked something from Gen 9 and Gen 4. So okay. let's take it back to the classics. Kanto, give me some Gen 1 power to Okay, I'm happy you chose this one because I would say it's the least scary, but also it's still really good. Uh, you have Kingdra. Oh, I got some Kingdra. Dude, that's my third dragon type, though. If you would have chosen Generation 4, it was an, a Palkia, but it's an origin form, so. Oh, I could have had the horse form Palkia. Yeah, <laughs> and then uh, your last uh, middle option was uh, Goldango. 
I don't know how you keep getting really good mods, but it keeps happening. Yeah, I, I appreciate you randomizing these ROMs, by the way, Toby. I, I got you. That's why they, they're like, hey, Tobin cheats. And I'm like, I physically don't. I do, would not give you these. Does he cheat or is he the most generous PokeTuber on the platform? <laughs> yeah, I can be generous. Maybe it's generosity. I don't know. I'm not. This randomizer's tragic, Tobin. Yeah, this will be fun. All right. I mean, hey, there's always one more round after this. So what, what do I got? Gen 7, Gen 5, and Gen 1. Seven, five, and one. Well, uh, since I, paid, oh God, I'm just gonna go Gen Five. It's competitive. They have a lot of competitive stuff. Let's just, what is it? Zeb Striker, baby. Wow. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> that's a, that's a choice. That is a Gen Five Pokemon. All right. All right. Well, it was Gen One. I almost went Gen One. Plafable. I mean, hey, it's Fairy type. That would actually probably would have been better. Damn it. All right. What was the first one? Uh, Vicky Volt. Both of them were better. Round number six, Tobin. Yup, it's the last <laughs> round. You ready to see your starters and see another legendary you might possibly get? Maybe it'll be full on shiny, who knows? Oh, no legend, wow, this is actually really good. But oh, the, cra no. the crazy part is uh, they're all still good. First one is generation seven. Okay, your gen seven? Yeah, your next one is gen one. And then your last one's gen five. So what are the odds that the gen seven Pokemon is also a gen one Pokemon? It's the odds are zero. <laughs> also, I haven't picked the Gen 7 in this whole video yet, so let, let's go for it. Give me some Sun and Moon action. I want an Ultra Beast. Nope. You got, well, they're not in this game, but you got Oricorio. I got a what? Oricorio. I got to say that a third time? Oricorio. I got a fake Pokemon? Nope. Oricorio. <laughs> this this game, this mod has fake mods in it? You missed out on War Turtle. And you also, okay. Yeah, and you also missed out on Excadrill. Oh, I'm kind of bummed missing out on Blastoise. That's always fun. It's always fun to bring the big turtle, but all right, we're looking at your last set of stars. Starters. Oh my god, that's possibly legendary. Possibly? He has his own battle theme. What? What do you mean possibly? <laughs> what the f All right, so we're looking at Gen 1 okay, most of the time. Not that one. Not that one. No, 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 no. We're looking at Gen 5. Okay. And we're looking at Gen 2. Which one? Okay, I would assume maybe Gen 5 is the own theme one, but what? I feel like you would know that it's legendary or not. That's so confusing. It, it's up in the air. It's actually kind of a coin flip. All right, we're going to go Gen 5 again. Question, would you call Keldeo a legendary? Yeah, I, 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 yeah, I think he's part of the Swords of Justice. He's like the fourth. Yeah, but are they legendaries or mythicals? Yeah, they're legendaries. They're like, <laughs> they're, I think they're 570 base stats, but so are like the legendary birds in Gen 1. Oh, those things are barely legendaries. Yeah, like, they're, just, they're just like legendary, but they don't have the base stats to back. It up. They were legendary in the 90s and, and now they're outclassed. Yeah, they're very outclassed. Yeah, the power they're scale just... was real. What were the other two options? Uh, Sandshrew or Skarmory? Ah, Skarmory would have been. I mean, that's a good support mod, but I don't need any more of those, so I will take Keldeo. <laughs> you already got your hazards guy. Like, yeah. Skarmory doesn't do much else after that. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, my team's, uh, you know, it's. It's okay. We'll see what happens <laughs> against your team. <laughs> Place your bets down in the comments. Are you Team Ryan or Team Tobin? Please, I need this win. You, I think they should be on your side. I'm going to be honest, guys. <laughs> I don't think Tobin's winning this one. This video is brought to you by Surfshark VPN. A VPN is something you use to protect yourself while browsing the internet. It stops hackers from identifying your IP address and stealing your personal information. Surfshark achieves this by changing your IP address and your location, which has the added benefit of unlocking more content on sites such as Netflix. And to make the service accessible to all users, Surfshark is super easy to install, and one subscription spans across multiple devices. Bundled with your Surfshark VPN package comes Surfshark Alert. This program will notify you whenever any of your personal information is ever leaked online. Surfshark also has an antivirus software, which has been proven reliable to keep your computer clean of malware, viruses, Trojan horse, and thousands of other issues. Surfshark even has a 24-7 customer support that you can contact at any time with any questions. And if it turns out that you're not the biggest fan of Surfshark VPN after using their service, there's a 30-day money-back guarantee so you can always cancel if you're not happy. Huge thanks to Surfshark VPN for sponsoring today's video, and let's get into the battle. Yeah, you did lead Queen Drill. That, that makes sense, because I feel like you flip turn here. I feel like that's smart. It's a good lead. Get some momentum. Yeah, but how am I going to flip turn if you're going to click fake out, Tobin? True. You, you, you right. You right. Just I also I like your nickname yeah. for the Persian. Yeah, you're going to switch out to your ghost type. Yeah. Well, yeah, you're clicking fake out. Totally. Yeah, I know. I, I want, dude, I had a different move. I could click here and I was like, just in case, just in case I'm not going to. Okay. All right. You want your ghost type. That's super fine with me. It's super fine. I want, I want to hit you harder, but. Oh, oh, that actually does some good damage. I am down with that. That was super effective and you outsped the tumbleweed. Going to mid. <laughs> Why are you calling him mid? He's a zebra, Tobin. <laughs> oh, you did not miss. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, that felt bad. Queendra, that's safe. Right, that's safe. That's pretty safe. Do you click flame charge? Uh, no, I had a, I had a, I had overheat actually. Um, and it's in the sun, so this should get boosted. 
Oh, yeah, because oh, I had drought on someone. So Yeah, you had drought on weed. I was like, oh, that kind of plays into my favor. <laughs> I played myself. <laughs> That's really funny. Okay. That's a lot of swapping we're doing here, huh? <laughs> it's a revolving door of Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I want to get some momentum, but this is this is hard. This has been a little weird. No, this is truly a competitive Draco. Pokemon. Draco? Oh, boy. Drop the Draco, baby. Oh, we, we eat it, though. We eat it. We eat it. That's good. That's good. Uh, my stats also got eight after that one. Yes, it did. Oh, my God. Wait a minute. This is good. This is good. This is actually really good. Tova, was that typo intentional? Yeah. Or? Yeah, Unicron. More fun than Unicorn. I thought it was another COVID strain, and I got very confused. Uh, oh, no. I thought I think Unicron's like a robot for Transformers. And I was like, oh, that would be kind of funny. I've never been huge into Transformers. It's fucking, you're so annoying with this. <laughs> fucking, this guy needs to die. I I'm know so that a fairy type move is coming. Or Secret Sword, which I'm a ghost type. Yeah, Let's go. <laughs> yeah, and the sunlight fades as soon as you swap in. That is on four. <laughs> yeah, you're not staying in on a grass type, so I just get a free, a free yeah. uh, power whip off again. Yeah, it's really annoying. I just feel like, like right now I have to get rid of this thing so I can, I can go for moves freely. All right, I'm going to just do <laughs> That he is mid. He is for sure mid. Yeah, not <laughs> the best Pokemon. That's a uh, Gen 5 in yeah. action right there. Now it's time to go into Puss in Boots. <laughs> Can I just say, I love this nickname for the Persian. I he's fine. Aw, I like Dude, him. did you see Shrek 5 got announced? I did. I did see that. I don't know where they left off in Shrek 4. I, I literally have only seen 1 and 2, and I saw the Puss in Boots movie, and that was it. <laughs> the Puss in Boots movie was really good, though. Yeah, the newest one. Yeah, that was very good. Very good. Knock off. See ya. <laughs> yeah. Rest in peace, weed. <laughs> yeah, I was kind of waiting to like, get in on him, but I was like, because I was like, I know if I knock him off one more time, he's dead. Now, what do you do? I'm pretty sure you outspeed everybody except Rayquaza, actually. All right, you are going to outspeed. That's good to know. That's good to know. Yo, I thought you were about to switch. I was like, no shot. He doesn't see the close combat coming. Uh, no, <laughs> I do. I do. But I got to be careful. I didn't want the Brave Bird to hit. So. Oh, you did... sturdy Persian. Yeah. Well, no, no. I got, I got focus as baby. <laughs> and I got gooey. Ew. Ew. And I just you turn out real quick. Yep. I just did oh. a slow pivot there. Because I, I wanted to see if you did outspeed. But now that I know you outspeed, this is really good for me. Chemical ROM. Oh, yeah. Okay, edgy Pokemon, edgy goth Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, yeah, baby, yeah. They're gonna clean up your looks with all the lies in the books to make a citizen out of you. Is that their, one of their songs? Yeah, it's called Teenagers. Oh, I didn't know that was their song. That's so funny. My Chemical Romance, baby. I don't, I'm not. I'm not good with you know putting names to songs to artists that well. Uh, I know the songs that Pilots. I like. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, I know Twenty One Pilots, and that's about it. Yeah, fun fact, 21 Pilots, Tobin's a big fan of them. Favorite band? Yeah, too much. I'm probably too much of a fan. All right, Coin Drug, come on in, buddy. I'm calm mining, though. Ooh! <laughs> He's trying to go for the MCR sweep. All right, all right. What are you doing against me now, buddy? I get very scared. I get insanely scared if there's attack boosts. Yeah, what are you going to do now? No, wait, wait, wait. This might be bad. We might be looking at a sweep situation. You go for the flip turn. Oh, well, uh, I'm built physically. <laughs> so that's Yikes. not going to do much. Actually, I have gentlemen's agreement. I, I have a question about Pokemon battles. Yeah, what's like. up? You know, there's other moves that we can click, right, Tom? No, no, I definitely need yeah, to yeah, call Gothitelle my Gothitelle has four moves. You can click any of them. Now I can start going crazy. Please don't, Tobin. <laughs> no, you still, ooh, you still fast. Wow, I still outspeed. <laughs> On four. All right, <laughs> what do you switch into? <laughs> I don't know. You, you, you could click anything here and I'll probably yeah. die. We're going Queendra. back to Queendra. That's a good, yeah, it's a good switch. Let's see, much of the, let's see how well you take this. So that, that's honestly a good switch because of that ability. But I have another gentleman's agreement vessel of ruin question. <laughs> yeah, what's up? <laughs> does it stack? <laughs> it does not stack. It all, it's only effective when you're on the field. Yeah, you got Terra Dark in the back somewhere? <laughs> I wish I did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a crit that time. Oh my, yeah, because that it. mattered, yeah. right? <laughs> they really did. It really did. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, this guy's nuts. How did I let this happen? How did I let a, a set up Gothitelle speed boost leftover situation? Oh, full odds, extreme full speed odds. Rayquaza. There he is. What, Delta stream? Yeah, what are the chances? My <laughs> randomized ability on Rayquaza. It was Mega Rayquaza's ability. <laughs> it's actually not that great for a randomized ability, but also like, I just love the fact that it coincidentally is Mega yeah, Rayquaza's yeah, ability. There's, there's extreme speed. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we gotta go Terra Normal, extreme speed. You uh, knew that was coming before the I, battle. Yeah, <laughs> no, I wish I had Prankster really bad because I could like charm you right now and lower your attacks super low, but uh, I, yeah, that I can't do anything crazy. about that. Yeah, I, right. I also think this is my only play because it's priority. And you have all the speed boosts up. 
flipped. I hate flipped. this game. <laughs> this guy is so crazy. And then he just gets one shot and not the shiny Rayquaza. My full odd shiny Rayquaza. Man, Gen 10 can't come soon enough, dude. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 am, I would love Gen 10 right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready to move on to Legends Zygarde, personally. <laughs> I'm so mad that I got swept by a Gothitelle in today's oh. battle video. Bird. <laughs> No, no, because we have the new office. It's a brand new background. Really hype. We're <laughs> back with the battle videos with a yeah. real clean L, baby. No, no, you, you can bring this back. He terrestrializes. <laughs> Just in case. <laughs> yeah, you never know what I might click after you kill me. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. You've like... never seen a battle video quite like this. Oh, yep. No, I definitely outspent yep, and kill. Yep, yep there yep. it is. <laughs> you saw that coming. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure. I didn't know, man. I was like, hey, maybe you have like an ability. I was like, no, I just want to be no, no, careful. No. You know what I love about battle videos? It's like, you never know how they're going to go. Like, you could get a Rayquaza, you could get a Reggie Draco, you could get an Orcorio, and you'll still get swept by a Gothitelle. Yeah, it happens. You know, I, I'm, honestly, rolling speed boost on this was crazy because, like, it just helps the store power set. I was like, oh, that's really good. Yeah, fake mon. Yeah, oh, he's so sending out the fake mon. Oh, the intimidate. Just in case. Yep. <laughs> Tobin, I always right. love doing battle videos with you, man. Okay. It was a good game. It was fun. It was a, it was good, a good time. Good game. Good hustle out there. Yeah, I, you know, I really tried. I really put 110% effort into my set. <laughs> GG's, baby. GG's. Oh, is it Vigoroth? Nope. Oh, uh, was it Slack Off? You actually got a shiny Rayquaza. No way! Full yeah. odds! No, that's... Nuts.